Thousands of people laced up their sneakers for the annual First Coast Heart Walk at the Jacksonville Fairgrounds. Take a look at the thousands of people who came together to honor victims of heart disease. This was during the American Heart Association's 100th anniversary. News for Jack's reporter Chris Will is hearing from one walker who is happy to be back on his feet. At the front of the line stands one Fru McAvoy. I'm feeling amazing, excited. If I could sprint this thing, I would. <laughs> I would run this because I'm just so happy. Running the three-mile loop is the goal for the 36-year-old, but standing here today is an accomplishment of its own. What did it take to get to this point? Wow. A lot of patience. Um, I have an absolute wonderful support system. I have a wonderful fiance uh, that stuck by me every single day in the hospital. Uh, 48 days to be exact. That's because at the end of last year, Fru suffered a stroke, marking the start of a 10-month-long journey to that starting line. Even standing here right now is such a blessing. I can't believe it. I'm getting emotional thinking about it. Uh, when I first went to Berks Rehab, they had to do an assessment on me, and I couldn't even stand for 30 seconds without help. So the balance is a big issue for me, but it's not going to stop me. And Fru is joined by over 15,000 other walkers, each with a story, many of them ringing the bell to signify their survival, but also to remember those they have lost. Yeah, heart disease affects everyone. You know, unfortunately, everyone can pinpoint someone in their life that has been affected by heart disease or stroke. And so it's important that we continue to spread the awareness that it is the number one killer, that it takes more lives than all forms of cancer combined, and that we come together and change that narrative and trajectory for our community. It's all a part of the First Coast Heart Walk put together by the American Heart Association. Thousands from across the region getting out and active to better themselves and raising over $1 million to help others. So it's really important from the prevention and awareness aspect that we continue, continue to get the word out, to advocate, and then to celebrate with loved ones, prioritizing our heart health and having some physical activity this morning. And when the event got started... Fru was among the many, just happy to be there. I'm rooting for everyone here today and every family that is going through a tough time. Don't ever give up. Don't ever give up the faith. In Jacksonville, Chris Will, Channel 4, The Local Station.